Hello, I'm Shao Marain. I have a cellular regeneration center in White Rock, British Columbia. Uh, we are here today to talk about bioceramic water technology with Dr. Ross Anderson. Uh, thank you so much for coming, Dr. Ross Anderson. What is bioceramic water technology? Well, bioceramic water technology is something that has just come into North America very recently. It is a way of changing the physical and chemical properties of water. And what that means simply is that the water is altered. We call it biotransformation. And the technology involves the use of bioceramics. Now we know that ceramics are materials that have been hardened uh, into very solid materials by heat and they've, they've actually formed crystalline structures in the material. And these materials can actually change the properties of water. So this particular device here looks like a fairly normal water filter pitcher, but is, it is extremely different. And this technology will actually change the water in some very profound ways. Number one, it will make the water very nicely alkaline. And as you know, our bodies need to be alkaline. Uh, How do you so, know that? Yes. Yeah. A lot of people are realizing that their bodies are too acid and we need to be alkaline. The technology will also add uh, a lot of hydrogen to the water. This changes the water in a couple of different ways. Number one, the water is far easier to absorb into your cells in your body. So drinking a glass of this is like drinking five glasses of other water, mm. which is a profound shift in the way water works in our bodies. So that added hydrogen changes the structure of the water and it also allows the water to act as an antioxidant. We know that vitamin C, vitamin A, vitamin E and other nutritional supplements are antioxidants because we are all being bombarded by free radicals. This water actually acts as an antioxidant because of the structure of the water and the available electrical energy from the water. So ultimately what we have here is a dramatically different way of filtering and changing water into water that is extremely beneficial for our bodies. Could this water, um, we poured this uh, just before uh, we started this tape, could this water be considered medicine? I know that's quite a question, but... It is, a very, it is a very interesting question, and water on this planet used to be like this. You can still get water like this that comes out of the ground in a few locations on the planet. A large amount of the water on this planet used to be like this hundreds, perhaps thousands of years ago. But now we are drinking water that has been altered by municipal water treatment and it's really difficult to get this kind of water. Is it actually a medicine? In some ways, uh, water should be our medicine. Our bodies are made up of 65 to 70 percent water and having the kind of water that works properly in our bodies actually could be considered to be uh, like a medicine. Well, here's to that, to have something that is so available, so easy, uh, no electrical outlet required, to take it with you anywhere, and uh, to have this level of activation and I travel. I travel with one of these all the time. Yeah, it's wonderful. Thank you. Pleasure. Awesome.